Hi everybody, my name is April and I'm going to show you how to do a trash to treasure make and take today. Um, so today we're going to show you guys how to make it your own kite. Um, we're going to provide you with pretty much every ounce of material that you need. The only thing that you will have to have is just some regular tape. Okay, so first thing you're going to do, you're going to get two of these little I don't know, dowel rods, I guess I think that's what they're called. And you're gonna wanna put them in like a T, like a cross kind of shape. And try to make it to where it's as even as possible on each side. Next thing you're gonna find in your little bags is like this long piece of like string. This is what you're gonna use to tie around your sticks. And the best thing that I can suggest to do is do it like in a cross shape pattern and you're gonna, it's gonna move your sticks a little bit at first, but once you get it kind of tightened into there, you're gonna take it around the one side a couple times on the string right there, and then you're gonna kind of take it around the back side of your top one, over the front and down and cross it the opposite direction, and take your string around that side a couple times. Do, 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 do. And you're gonna keep doing this until you get all the way around your string um, and use the rest of your string whatever and then you'll just kind of tie it off at the end so you'll have it to where it kind of looks like this when you're done okay once you have that finished I'm not going to go any further and tie it off you're going to have this drawstring bag that I'm pretty sure I think we're going to put everything in that you're going to need but then you're going to use the bag so what you're going to do is you're going to take the bag I've already cut mine in half um, because I used it to, for the final product. But you're gonna lay one side of your bag down, take your little cross thing that you have here for your kite, for your base, this is kind of like your base for your kite. Put it on your blue um, bag here, mine's blue, yours might be red, silver, there's a couple different colors um, that you could possibly have. And you're just gonna take a marker or a pen, mark the top of where each stick is. Once you do that, move your stick off to the side and you're going to take your scissors. These you'll provide yourself too. We're not going to give everybody scissors. Sorry guys. Sorry, I'm folding it the wrong way. Fold it to where you can actually see your lines and then cut where that little line slit is. So you make little open slits in your bag all the way around. There we go. So those were not cutting as well there. Let me do it to this one. Cut. So you'll go around each side, making these little cuts, because once you do, your, your little base for your kite is what's gonna go into this shape. Okay. So once you do that, put your stick back over here, flip it down to make sure that your holes are big enough, it's going to fit on your stick right before you cut out your diamond shape. So it'll kind of look like this as you're flipping your things around. You just want to make sure that they line up well. Once you figure that out, you'll cut out your diamond shape, cut out your bag. I don't know if I can get this to cut very well with these scissors, probably not. Um, Make sure as you're cutting your bag to go above where your little slits are. Um, Cause you don't want to cut those. You need to have that at the top corners of your kite all the way around. Once you do that, Wow, these scissors are terrible. These are really bad. Key point, guys, make sure you have good scissors. <laughs> this is awful. Okay. And granted, this is a plastic bag, so these scissors do not cut plastic very well. Okay, just 
discard that to your side. Take your stick, put it back on your little thing here. I did not cut this out very well because those scissors are terrible, but that's okay. So you're gonna take the corners of your, of your kite, your little triangle, flip it down over your stick. This is where your tape comes in. Get yourself a little piece of tape and you're gonna tape it onto your stick like this. And then, oops, mine's sliding a little bit. You're gonna wanna wrap your tape around and that'll help secure your kite piece onto your sticks. So you'll do that all the way around until it's completely sealed. Once you've done that, you will also find some different um, ribbon pieces in your bags. Your ribbon pieces, you then you can take and you can just tie them around the bottom of your kite. So then once it's done and you've taped all of these corners around, your kite will look just like this. Obviously, it's probably not going to fly outside, but you do have your own kite and you can hang it up in your room, um, in your house, outside, off your porch, wherever you like. Hope you guys enjoy. Bye.